Sin is the main antagonist of the world of Final Fantasy X, a giant beast similar to a whale that threatens the world of Spira. Sin was created in Xenarkand to counter-develop during the Machina War, while Xenarkand was losing the war. The summoner Yuyevan calls all the survivors of the city together, transforming them into faith, using them to create sin to counter the enemy. Later, however, the power of sin was too great, and Yuyevan was no longer able to manage a monster driven by his instincts. Thus giving vent to his destructive power throughout spirit. On the other side is Moby Dick, considered a legendary sea monster based on the novel by Herman Melville. Represented as a beast that is both destructive, powerful and savage. Moby Dick is a giant white sperm whale that Captain Ahab is determined to kill at all costs. In the process, the captain goes mad and the battle between man and beast becomes a final and epic battle. What do have in common the two beasts? Both beasts represent the sin that men have shown to dare to go against the very nature of things. In practice as regards sin, the greatest sin represent the machina built by man. So much so that, for example, Wackov strongly hates the Machina being that he himself believes very much in Yevon's beliefs. Moby Dick instead represents the stubbornness of taking revenge against animals. Hence the sin of forcibly chasing a beast like Moby Dick by Captain Ahab which becomes an obsession. Consequently, a very strong grudge that will be fatal for the captain. Sin can be compared to a whale, while Moby Dick is a sperm whale, so basically including Sin they are cetaceans. Both are two antagonists who destroy everything they find mercilessly, which is because they are hated by many people to whom the latter thus seek their personal revenge, or seek some chance to stop them. While both are driven by their own instincts, sin differs slightly from this. As sin reincarnates each time through the sacrifice of one of the summoner's guardians, A process that occurs after the Guardian thus becomes the final Leon, thus defeating Sin, and which in turn will take its place. However, part of the Guardian's existence within the Beast can slightly deflect the monster's instinct in favor of reason. Furthermore, it can be said, that both beasts manage to drive crazy those who manage to survive their encounter. For example, Sin has in its outer layer of the Sin Spin, that in the long run whoever is next to him causes problems to the person. While as regards Moby Dick, Captain Ahab has managed to survive many times against his opponent, driving him crazy more and more. Sin can be seen as a being that violates the ideal relationship between an individual and God. Or as any deviation from the perceived ideal order for human life. 
such a comparison perhaps most attributable in Melville's work to Captain Ahab. Instead of Moby Dick, as the captain becomes so insane that he completely loses faith, going against his idealistic principles himself. Both beasts are unforgettable beings that will forever remain in history and in our minds.